What if you could build nine Gen A projects in just two months and launch it before 2025 is over? So hi guys, welcome to Freebirds Two, and let me give you a nine high impact projects on Rag, Agentic AI, and LLMs with ideas with tech stack along with the system design diagrams as well that you can easily build in the next eight to ten weeks and build your own portfolio as well. But why does this matter now? because gen a is exploding demand of ml engineer or ai engineer are rising and having a finished project is a huge differentiator on your resume or github profile and these projects can also help you to align with the market needs sell branding of skills on github or linkedin and also get more job opportunities as well so here's how you, you can pick your first project for yourself first choose something that is aligned with your skill set but slightly a stretch not too complex for you and then estimate your time frame and treat it like a mini project and then use the tech stack that i mentioned for each project and deploy something live on the ui like streamlit or flask as well and most importantly document it using readme files videos or github and so you finish with something to show as well okay so now let's go to the ideas the first topic is about the rag and llm based projects so in which the first project we have is advanced multi-source rag for enterprise knowledge base in which you are building a QA system that ingests data from three distinct sources like pdfs websites or uh, databases as well and uses multiple retrievers like vector search sentence window retrieval or graph based retrieval as well and then merge all the retrieval context and re-rank them before sending to the llms and then deploy it via streamlit in which you will learn about RAG, vector DBs, graph retrieval, re-ranking, uh, LangChain or Llama index along with the deployment on the Azure and AWS platform. And you can use the tech stack such as Python, Hugging Face, Llama index for indexing, FAST or the Pinecone as a vector DBs and a simple front-end UI like Streamlit and deploy it on the AWS EC2 instance or Azure as well. And the end product that you should create must have a web interface where a user uploads files or points to a website or a CSV or a database and ask a natural language question and get precise answer with the source citations. And if all goes well, you can also add a feature that can shows the customer about the latency, accuracy trade-off along with the include citations or document sources as well to boost the credibility of your project. And here is the whole system design workflow that you can use to manage your process and build this whole project as well. Got it? Okay. So now let's move to the next project that is called as chat with your code base and in which you are building an intelligent assistant that uh, lets developers literally chat with their code bases this system will ingest code source files documentations commit messages from a large open source repository like a uh, lang chain uh, llms with vector databases as well and code specific chunking metadata filtering llama index and lang chain and ccd automation as well and you can use the tech stack to build this project r python lang chain for ingestion and retrieval logic fast vector db and Gemini Flash as the LLM and GitHub Actions for the CACD pipelines as well and Streamlit for the UI and that can show the snippet context and the AI explanations as well. And at the end product that you should create must have a developer friendly web interface where you can ask and uh, simple questions about your repository and it will give you the code snippets or, along with the LLM generated explanations about the code as well. And if all goes well, you can add a new feature that can filter via file types or the modules and make the retrieval more faster as well. And here is the whole design workflow that you can use to manage your process and build this whole project as well. Got it? So now let's move to the next project that is multi-model rack for e-commerce product assistant in which you are building an AI shopping assistant that understands both the image along with the text. Our system first uses an image to text model to describe the image, then it uses the textual description to query the vector DB. And a customer can upload a photo of any product. Let's say it can upload a pair of sneakers or a laptop and ask the chatbot to about like what specs does this model have or show me a similar product under the $500 like this. Okay. And in this project, you will learn, you will learn about 
uh, multimodal rag, vision plus language models, along with the vector DB search, uh, image embeddings, and uh, the description generation, and the cross model retrieval fusions, uh, web deployment with the Streamlit as well. And you can use this tech stack to build this project R, Python, Langchain, or Llama and Text for uh, data cleaning or chaining, and the Gemini vision model. Fast for the product embeddings and the Gemini Flash for the text LLMs as well and Streamlit for the front end and AWS Lambda for the deployment as well. And the end product that you should create must have a modern web-based AI assistant where users can upload product name, product image and ask information about it and it can give the answer with the uh, retrieve docs, links and the visual context as well. Think it like a chat GPT plus uh, Google Lens plus Amazon search as well. Okay, it's kind of that kind of a project as well. And if all goes well, you can add a feature to use image captions plus structured metadata into your vector store for better retrieval accuracy. Add visual results in the chat response for a maximum wow factor as well. Okay, and here is the whole design workflow that you can use to manage your process and build the whole project as well. Okay, got it? Now, the list of our next projects are from the Agent AI, in which our first project would be Financial Analysis Agent Crew, in which you are building a multi-agent AI system, basically a small AI team that collaborates to generate comprehensive stock analysis report. Each agent has a distinct role, just like a real financial research department. It has a market research agent that gathers the latest news, tweets, and the financial updates, data analyst agent as well that pulls the prices data run kpis and the chart performances as well and a report writer agent that synthesizes all the things from the last two agents into a professional report or a summary as well and in this project you will learn about agentic ai tool calling or the function calling and orchestration framework like agno or the autogen as well along with the api integrations in, into the ai agents as well and autonomous reasoning or the task chaining and the pdf and the report generation by using the pi pdf or the f pdf2 libraries as well and you can build this project by using the core frameworks such as Agno or Autogen for the orchestration, Yahoo Finance API, and the computational tools such as Python Pandas or Matplotlib for KPI charts as well, and FPDF2 for the report generation, and Gemini LLM for the reasoning and the report writing, and uh, the whole deployment on the AWS Lambda as well. And at the end product that you should create must have an end-to-end -end AI analyst crew that can take a company name or the stock ticker as an input and the agent collaborate one researches, one analyze and one writes and generate a structured financial report. Okay. And if all goes well, you can also add a conversation log showing how agents communicate with each each other behind the scenes and viewers will love to see how ai can talk with itself include the error correction logic as well okay and here is the whole design workflow that also has the error correction logic that you can use to manage your whole process and build this whole project as well okay and for this i have an example project on my channel already do check that for the inspiration link is in the i button got it so now now our next project is self-correcting data validation agent in which you are building an autonomous ai agent that can validate correct and standardize unstructured user data completely on its own think of it like a ai data janitor that not only clean the data but also learns from its own mistake as well it has a built-in uh, ai validator that tools check for the data meets about the data validation rules as well and if validation fails the agent self critiques or the reprompts itself to fix the issue okay and in this project you will learn about agent ai self corrections and the error handling land graph for the logic controls and the schema enforcement with the pydentic as well and the prompt tuned llm for the structured extraction and the data validation and the retrial logics in the ai agent as well and you can build this project by using Langraph for the feedback loops, Pydentic for the schema enforcement, Gemini Flash LLM with the Streamlit as a front end, Fast API as a back end, and hosted on the AWS Lambda, and SQLite or MongoDB to store the original and the corrected responses as well. And at the end, 
product that you should create must have a clean web interface where customers can paste messy data and the agent extract the structured JSON, validate it, and, and it can give you a cleaner output in a schema formatted word. Okay, and if all goes well, you can also visualize the self correction loop in your demo, a circular animation or the state machine diagram that can show that how your AI is actually changing the text there as well. It looks like a wow factor again as well. Okay, and here is the whole design workflow that you can use to manage your process and build this whole project as well. How oh guys, uh, got it? Okay, so now our next project in the list is AI Power Test Case Generator in which you are building an AI agent that can automatically generate unit test cases from natural languages feature descriptions as well. And this system uses a code specialized large language model to interpret the requirement, generate the code and even integrate into the CI-CD pipeline so that every new feature or a change automatically gets its own test case added. So just imagine like you type uh, the lo login page should reject wrong password and display an error message and, and instantly you get a ready to run test case with function in Python or the JavaScript written by the AI agent as well. And in this project, you will learn about agentic AI code generation using LLMs, tool calling or file system access, CACD integrations and prompt chaining and validation as well. And you will build this project using core engines like Langchain, Code Llama, FastAPI as backend, CACD pipeline for automated tests and PyTest as a testing framework along with the Streamlit as a front end. And the end product that you should create must have an AI powered test case generator that accepts the natural language feature description, generate corresponding unit test or integration test, and optionally commits them to the CI CD workflow and run the test and show pass fail output as well. And if all goes well, you can also add a feature that demonstrates the full pipeline flow in your video like a requirement to AI to generate test to CI CD run and then the green check and include a code viewer panel with syntax highlight so that the audience can see the new code get, uh, generated by the LLM as well. And here is the whole design workflow that, that you can use to manage your whole process and build this whole project as well. Got it? Okay, so now let's move to the next part. So next part belongs to the LLM and optimization projects in which our first project is LLM fine tuning for a specialized industry chatbot in which you are building a specialized domain chatbot, a small but a mighty LLM trained on the Excel in a narrow high value field. The project focuses on the fine tuning of an open source model like a Lama 3, 8 billion or Mistral 7D as well. Using lightweight methods such as LoRa, QLoRa, your goal is to show measurable performance improvement over the base model and deploy it as an API on the hugging face or a web app as well. And in this project, you will learn about LLM fine tuning or the uh, custom dataset creation or the parameter efficient fine tuning like uh, LORA or QLORA, the evaluation and the benchmarking, the hugging face ecosystem, fast API deployment for serving the fine tuned models as well. And you can build this project by using the model base as Llama 3.8B and Mistral 7B or the 5.3 Mini as well. And fine tuning frameworks such as the PEFT that is parameter efficient fine tuning or the a custom data set of the company and the training tools such as the PyTorch, Accelerate and the BIS and Byte for the quantization and evaluation and fast API deployment and Streamlit frontend as well. And the end product that you should have must have a working specialized chatbot that understands and answers questions about your chosen niche and performs better than the general base model and ready for the uh, API integration as well. And if all goes well, you can also add the feature that choose the domain which freely available text uh, data as well and visualize your training curve and evaluation matrices and show a quick comparison between the past model and the new model with the same question answered as well. Okay, and here is the whole workflow that you can use to build your whole project and also manage your whole process as well. Got it? Okay, so now let's move to the next project. That is Guardrail and Forced Content Moderation API in which you are building a content moderation API that does not just block or block bad inputs. It also thinks, reason and defend itself against 
malicious prompt and the unsafe content as well using model chain prompting technique you will create a multi step ai sta uh, safety pipeline that have features to do like a uh, toxicity and prompt injection check and the content policy validation and the final input generation as well and in this project you will learn about the model chain prompting guardrails and safe uh, safety filters prompt injection defense content policy enforcement and the fast api as well and you can build this project using llm layer 1 that is a safety layer and llm layer 2 that is a content generation layer and the frameworks such as langchain or the guardrails ai you can use for validation logics and fast api as backend and you can deploy it on the aws lambda and you can use mongodb for storage and you can monitor the results using the prometheus as well and the end product that you should create must have a live api or a demo app that accepts any user input runs it through the multiplication moderation checks and blocks or rewrite the unsafe messages logs flag interactions for the admins as well and if all goes well you can also add a feature that can use a split screen demo the left side is the unsafe input the right side is the flagged with the reason include a log viewer ui that that you can shows that it has a violation in the real time as well and here is the whole workflow diagram that you can use to manage your process now also build this whole project as well got it okay so now let's move to our last project that is called as the real time video and audio summarization pipeline in which you can building an end to end ai pipeline that listens understand and summarizes the long videos audios lecture podcast or meetings all in the real time and when user uploads a file a system uses the speech to text to transcribe then use the llm pipeline to summarize key takeaways action items or the discussion points from that audio or video file as well and and in this project you will learn about multi modal ai speech to text llm chaining for multi stage processing structured output parsing by using the pydentic and the lang chain for the orchestration and the deployment on the aws and build this whole project by using the speech to text using the whisperx and lang chain for the chaining and the orchestration gpt4 o or the gemini llms fast api and the streamlit for the front end and mongodb or the sqlite for the storage and deployment on the hugging face or the aws and at the end product that that you should create must have a clean interactive web app that can accept a video audio uploads generate a real time transcription and summarizes content into the short bullet points and action item and display everything nearly in a dashboard with time stamp and the copy and download options as well and if all goes well you can also add a new feature that can show the full pipeline visually waveform animations and a transcript appearing ai summary generation in real time as well and use the split screen to show left side is the transcript building live and right side is the summary and the key insights and add a progress bar as well like ai thinking to show a dramatic effect as well you can make it like a more uh, ai system in that way okay and here is the whole design workflow that that you can use to build your whole project and manage your whole processes and build this project before 25 and let me know how many of you already build and if you have any questions any doubt you can ask me in the comment section as well and if you want to learn about generative ai agentic ai rag or uh, machine learning or deep learning you can watch my videos on youtube and also read my blogs on medium channel as well and we'll meet in the next video thank you guys thank you so much